Minnesota State has announced three finalists for chancellor. The candidates are vying to succeed Stephen Rosenstone, who will retire when his current contract expires on July 31st. Rosenstone has served as system chancellor since 2011. Here's a look at the three finalists. Michael Martin is Chancellor Emeritus and Senior Fellow at the Colorado State University System, where he served as Chancellor from 2012 to 2015. Previously, he served as Louisiana State University Chancellor, New Mexico State University as President, and the University of Florida as Vice President for Agriculture and Natural Resources. Keith Miller is President Emeritus of Lock Haven University, Pennsylvania, where he served as President from 2004 to 2010. He also served Virginia State University as president and the University of Wisconsin Oshkosh as provost and as vice chancellor. And Kathy Sandine has served as the chancellor of the University of Wisconsin Colleges and the University of Wisconsin Extension since 2014. Previously, she served the American Council of Education as vice president of educational attainment and innovation and the University of California, Los Angeles as dean of continuing education, UCLA Extension. On February 7th and 8th, the candidates will interview with members of the Board of Trustees, college and university presidents, and members of the Chancellor's Cabinet, and will participate in an employee forum. The Minnesota State College and University Board of Trustees will consider the appointment of a preferred candidate on Thursday, February 9th at 10 a.m. The new Chancellor's term will begin August 1st. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.